Use of prohibited substances and methods in sports goes against the spirit of fair play. It also damages the body of the athlete. Here's a look at the risks associated with the use of performance-enhancing prohibited substances. Anabolic androgenic steroids or AAS are used to improve athletes' physical and physiological capacity to train and compete at the highest level by reducing fatigue and recovery duration. The side effects are extremely serious, ranging from tumors, liver and kidney dysfunction, to breast development in males, and male pattern hair growth in females. Other anabolic agents like clenbuterol and xerenol can cause arrhythmias and muscle cramps. Hormones like erythropoietin or EPO increase the number of red blood cells, leading to increased blood viscosity, which may lead to stroke and pulmonary embolism. Human growth hormones or HGH and human chorionic gonadotropin or HCG are used by athletes for muscular strength. But it may cause acromegaly or overgrowth of limbs and gynecomastia or breast development in males. Adrenocorticotrophin or ACTH hormone is believed to improve muscular strength. Its side effects include stomach ulcers and osteoporosis. Beta-2 agonists, if taken intravenously, have anabolic effects. That is why a TUE or Therapeutic Use Examination Certificate is required for the use of inhaled beta-2 agonists by asthmatic athletes. Hormone antagonists and modulators used to counteract undesirable side effects of anabolic steroids may lead to gastrointestinal disorders and venous thrombosis. Diuretics and other masking agents impair the excretion of prohibited substances to conceal their presence in urine. Stimulants like amphetamine, cocaine and ephedrine cause alertness and increased ability of concentration. Many OTC cough and cold medications contain stimulants, so athletes need to avoid them. They can lead to malfunction of the cardiovascular system and other vital organs and in some cases even death. Narcotics derived from morphine and cannabinoids like marijuana, hashish and hashish oil are used for pain relief, but their prolonged use may lead to addictions and cancers. Besides, beta blockers and methods like blood doping, chemical and physical manipulations and gene doping are also banned by WADA.